Hello world, lockpicking dev here. Today I'm on Hotback Mountain and I brought myself a Packlock UCS 10A. Let's see if we can get the sucker open real quick. It has six pins and full of security pins. And it is a beautiful day out to pick a lock on a mountain. Pin two. Under it, there we go. It's been two. Nothing on six. X. Two and there's our open. There we are. Pack like UCS 10A. Let's find our keys. There's our bedding. So that way you can see that. When we get home, I will definitely gut this. I'm gonna show you around without falling and dying here. We're on a whole bunch of boulders right here below. And off into the distance over that way is Rainier. Let's see up there. And a beautiful blue day. Here's what I'm sitting on top of all oh, this type of scramble. Yeah, this is Humpback Mountain, and I will be home soon to get that for you. All right, we're back home. Now let's get this gutted. There we go. Four and oh yeah our plug retaining screw up here unscrew that that way we can use our follower there we go that's good enough <clears throat> and actually because i know there's a retaining screw there i'm going to turn this a little bit further 
to make sure we clear that gap. There we go. So that should be good. So it's a follower. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. And see, there's that gap, a retaining plug gap. You've seen those a lot recently in some of the puck locks I've got it in picked. And top pins. One. Mr. Two, come on out. Here we go. Four, five, and six. In typical pack lock fashion. The last pin is a long standard. Here we go. We have a spool. Serrated, serrated, spool, spool, and a long standard in the back right there. And that was a Packlock UCS 10A on Humpback Mountain. Alright everyone, thanks for watching.